Happiness through curiosity on the Ranveer Show. Welcome to TRS Clips. My mother, she used to pray for people. And you know, sometimes people carry energies. Sometimes they are good and bad. And what, what do you mean carry? My mother, she used to pray for many, many people. And many, many different people came. People who were Satanist, you know, in the cult of Satanist. So they have very dark energy, very... They carry dev like devil energy inside them. So can we talk a little bit about this? Yeah. Because this is a very kind of specific to the West okay. narrative, and even I would like okay. to know about yeah, it yeah. because you only see these in movies and video yeah, yeah. games. So um, we call devil um, El Diablo. Course. El Diablo, very good. <laughs> so um, and with the devil, they they are very many different demons. So some demons are like in charge of the, how you call lust, envy, jealous, you know, each demon. Seven sins. Anger. Yeah, all of them. And they have forms and they have energy, like you can feel the energy. And it say like, it, it doesn't say because I, I experienced, I saw, I saw with my eyes, so I know it's real. Um, so people were carrying this kind of, entities inside them and my mother was kind of doing exos exorcisms you saw exorcisms yes i saw i saw it it was very scary because my mother she was very powerful she was also sweet healing prayers but she ha she become like a warrior and she was kind of fighting with these entities inside people so for example it was a girl she was in satanic cult and she wanted to go out and they were disturbing her so much. I remember so well about it. But w what's the point of joining a satanic cult? They do rituals, they do uh, worship to the devil, things for, like for that. For what? For power? Can be power or whatever, they, whatever they want to achieve, like materialistic achievements only. Do, like, you, think, do you think it happens in India? I, I think so. <laughs> I think so. I, I believe um, it's everywhere in the world. It's, it's just different names. Uh, but I do know that there are some worshippers of Kali who are like kind of, this, they can use like kind of this energy, very, very dark energy. But, um, you know, I, I didn't explore that that here at mm. all. Mm. It's Kala Jadu uh, energy. That's what they call it. Black magic. Okay, yeah. But I think it's, the energy is the same. Yeah, I, I believe so. I, but yeah, for example, this girl, the satanic girl, she was trying to go out from that, but she just feel like they were disturbing her every single night. And in the soup, she just was finding, like she was drinking, uh, take, uh, eating soup. In Spanish, we say drinking, but uh, in mm -hmm. English, eating soup and she find her. Things like, you know, like disgusting things. It's, it was just like black magic like as on in, her. Um, she would hallucinate about the. No, it was, actually it, it was actually things like that, and she so she wanted to leave this kind of people, and she was she knew about my mother. My mother was very popular in some time in her life, like when we were kids, and she knew about my mother. And as soon as we saw her, immediately we felt the energy. You know, our skin was like like a chicken skin, and we were like. I could feel the energies. I got very sensitive, especially when my mother, when I was with my mother, I was very, very sensitive. I saw, I saw many, like, entities. I saw many, many things. We, we saw how they throw the doors, things like that. Can can you describe with this girl what happened? Yeah, she was. Um, she came and she, my mother, my mother was praying for her. My mother said, "Go up, because she have a very, very dark, dark energy." And what my mother didn't take care so much is just she was praying for all these people in our house. So later the entities were disturbing us. So this girl came, she was praying, and of course they started speaking in different language, language that you don't even understand. And they start shouting with different voices. You saw this? Yes, <laughs> many times. Many uh, times? Yeah. Like in, in it's, all... It's, it's like the movies, it's like exorcisms. It's actually, this is not fictional. This is there for a reason because it's happened. Please. So my mother was doing all these things. She was taking these devils from people. Like, w Have you ever spoken to your mother about what it was like interacting with those energies? 
She have to become like a warrior. I, I was like just watching at her and I was looking and she shouts at them. She says like in the name of God, you. that's why I'm saying the names are very, very powerful. You know, names are names. That's why, okay, maybe I, I will connect this. Like, I don't know if this is connected, of, but the Maha Mantra, the Hare Krishna is chanting names of God. What are you bringing to your life? You are bringing peace, love, devotion. That's why... Protection. Protection, everything. The chanting, the speaking is so powerful, it's so important. That's why this is the process right now we are doing. That's why you see so many people chanting Hare Krishna even in the streets because they want to share the names and bring positivity around. So it's very, very powerful. So my mother was like invoking the name of God and they say, you you are not anymore here. You have to go from this party. You have to leave her alone. And, and then sometimes some of the energies were staying in our house and they were disturbing us. You felt it as well? Yeah. They were open our doors. They were playing with our toys. They were turn, turning on the TV. I was like, oh, this is so annoying. But um, did you see anything visually? Yeah. You saw things visually? Yeah, yeah. Are you okay talking about it? Yeah. Okay, what did you see? Uh, I saw many times, different times. One day we were having holidays in one farm in Colombia. You know, vacations, we were just family vacations. And I saw these big, dark um, men walking around the pool. You know, like he was walking around the pool. And my, my mother was trying to pray so hard because we all look like it, it was not a human. We, we all saw him. So we all have that open vision in those times. Now, I don't have. You mean in childhood? Because they say that a child is much purer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Than... we are more pure, so we get it more. Uh, but in those times, I was like, seeing everything. I saw also what, that they, I don't know what happened in that farm. It was like full of all of them. So I saw, I, I opened my eyes and the whole, um, ceiling was full of a dark how you call it, like cloud and they were like entities moving like like that like horrible you know like sometimes you watch these things in movies and people they don't know that these things exist like sometimes it's just like a dark energy is moving humans moving around them you know it was very very dark my sister saw a lady sitting in her bed we were all seeing things that night and we were like, oh my God, we would just want to go out. And, and then we all end up in my mother's bed. And we were like, because my mother is very, very powerful. She doesn't, she was not scared at all. All these things were coming into your house because she was fighting with such energies? Yeah, even she, she now she realized that she, she shouldn't do that so openly. Why? She stopped it. Just to let you know, she stopped it. Uh, after some years, she stopped it. And that's... One of the reasons I will be very honest with you, because I saw she was amazing, she's super powerful, but these things doesn't make a kid happy, you know? That's why I wanted something more <laughs> gentle, <laughs> like I want a process more relaxed. But did these things that you saw ever try to harm you or your siblings? They were not harming you. We were, my mother was very, very powerful. They were scared of my mother, but they were just disturbing. Like trying to scare. They, they, if you them. if you have God in you, they cannot touch you. They cannot do anything. But because we were kids, we were just scared, you know? They were just disturbing us. But what? never happened like nothing. Thank you for watching this clip. If you want to learn more about this topic, we've curated a playlist just for you. And here's a link to the whole episode.